Hey everybody, um, I'm over here today at the house going to try and get a few things done. We really want to pick out some exterior colors so I have a few samples to look at and we're going to test them out back here. I'm excited. I think they're they're good colors that fit uh, the time period and we, we like them so you'll have to let us all know what you think. And Emmanuel's working all weekend. He has a big project going on so it'll just be me. It's going to be hot. It's going to get up to like a hundred this week. Today we're getting started early and we're in the shade so we should be pretty good. All right. I wanted to try a warm and a cool color scheme. And so we've got um, some greens with like a dark brown um, for the sashes and accent and maybe a white trim and the two greens for the body of the house. And the other option is something with some blues and uh, we would still use the brown um, accent and the white trim. I'm just going a little bit lighter and I was thinking of doing a darker green um, up on the shingles um, that are up on the second floor of the house and have those two greens as the body.
breeze today, so I'm really thankful for that. It really feels nice and cool. trying to pick out some exterior paint colors so I have a few samples that um, I think would work well and are kind of fitting that time period I think and um, so we're gonna try them out and you guys can help us decide and um, we'll go from there You can see you have to kind of maybe cover like one half at a time. You can see on that side the greens. Um, cover that up too. So we're just looking at those greens there. And on the other side are the blues. Like that. The blues don't have as much contrast as I expected. But I think they would still work together because they won't be right next to each other. We would probably have the dark color up on the shingles. Oh, I've got to step back. The dark color would be all the way up there. And then the light color would probably be the rest of the um, siding. So I think that could work. And then we would do a dark 
uh, color on the sashes. Either, I think for the greens, it might be nice to have even a dark red or kind of a rusty brown color on the sashes as a nice contrast. I think on the blue side, we would do a um, dark brown if we went with that um, color scheme. So let us know what you think. So it's Sunday and um, Sunday afternoon, Emmanuel is with me as you see. So we're really excited to work together today. Um, his weekend went well yesterday, so we're gonna get some work done here and try and clean up the, the staircase a little bit more. So, all right. <laughs>
right here. The opening starting here. And that gives us still enough room there to pee so a little bit of wall next to it. Yeah. But it gives us enough space so that we can put the table as far over wherever and we'll move around. Uh -huh. So if we would measure from here and then over here, I would think we want to go as far as we can. Because everything else is an island anyways, so why not have the island start like oh, all the way corner? Small. So we can put the oh, post, I mean there might be a post right here in the corner. Yeah. But it would be One right there from this there. open all the way over. Um, my baby bump so we have a new arrival coming in November uh, baby girl so we're excited about that all right everybody well that's all we have today uh, we did a little bit more cleaning over here at the house and it was really nice just to um, work together over here. I can't speak for Emmanuel, but for me it was really fun to just spend time over together. Don't forget to like and subscribe and um, comment your thoughts and uh, choose your favorite colors for the house. Thanks. Thanks. See you next week. Bye.